welcome to my binding video. This video compares the Quailmax EPI and EPI Plus. The very top of the Quailmax line is the EPI. Let's look at the differences. The first is the number of disengageable die pins, and the second is the type of hole punched. All of the punch pins on the EPI Plus are fully disengageable, allowing you to use any size sheet of paper. The regular EPI model has only five disengageable pins to be used with the most common sizes of paper. The EPI cuts round holes that are four millimeters wide. The Plus model punches oval holes. The difference is oval holes work better with larger or thicker documents. Also, oval holes are easier to begin the threading process of the coil onto the spine. Those are the differences. Now let's look at the similarities between the two models and why the EPI is the top of the line. Both machines punch at a four to one pitch and have a punching length of 13 inches. It is an open throat design, so with some creativity, there's no limit on paper size. The motor on this electronic punch can handle up to 20 sheets of 20 pound paper per lift, and the binding capacity with the electronic inserter is 7 8 inch. Punching remains consistent both with side margin and depth of margin control knobs. One pedal to be operated by hand or foot controls both the punch as well as the inserter, and with the switch on the front of the machine, you toggle between the two. And this inserter roller certainly stands out as the best on the line. Both machines come with a handheld coil selecting tool as well as a free pair of coil crimping pliers. Now all you need to do is choose what's best for you. For more comparisons, demos, reviews, and how-tos, check out mybinding.com.